Cyclops, a new ultra-strong lightweight manned submersible born of the partnership between the UW's Applied Physics Laboratory and OceanGate. Cyclops was developed with the goal of being a, a totally new approach to manned submersibles. Cyclops is designed to take up to five people as deep as 10,000 feet. It could do both research, environmental assessment work for oil and gas, mining, surveying work, biopharma, and even adventure tourism. OceanGate brings to the table experience in small subs. This is Antipodes, veteran of more than 100 dives in the past two years. This is a new, kind of a new venture for us. APL brings to the table the ability for a company like OceanGate to come into the university and gain access to resources and gain access to technology that they may not have available to them. APL brings in the ability to do computational fluid dynamics. In other words, how much force, how much power does it require to move this vehicle through the water at a given speed? Cyclops is aimed at customers who need to charter deep sea access, previously the domain of military submarines, or submersibles tethered to support vessels of a size and cost Cyclops won't need. We can use an ocean-going tug that might be $10,000 a day versus a specialized research ship that would run, say, $100,000 a day. Cyclops will employ carbon fiber reinforced plastic, the same material Boeing uses to build jetliner wings. New carbon fiber manufacturing techniques, new high purity glass, as well as new control systems. Why risk people where robots can go? Subs are extremely safe when operated as a research vessel, not as a military sub. Robots can't do everything. There's a place for, for people in the ocean, and we're looking at first commercial operations in 2016. Science at work for you. This is APL, the Applied Physics Laboratory at the University of Washington in Seattle.